Howdy Survivors! I've got some really striking news for you today. Rumors about the upcoming faction turned out to be true. Strangers started to gather in the valley. It is said that the engineers were the first to contact them. I've got no idea of what they could be talking about out there, but the strangers called themselves Syndicate. I have a feeling that soon all the wasteland will be set on fire. We are happy to introduce a new major update, Crossout Syndicate. In the game, there are new structural parts, a new season, and the battle pass, and moreover, a new city map. Now let us right into the most explosive part, the parts of the new faction. No more winding up before the race, here is the legendary Keju Cannon. The massive weapon requires unbelievable power of 11 energy units. If you can master this bulky cannon, you will become a true horror of the wasteland. This weapon uses the mechanics of the charged fire. The longer you press the fire button, the longer the round will shoot and the farther distances it can reach. The maximum speed of your vehicle is reduced during the charge because it consumes enormous amounts of energy. According to the first data we gathered, the members of Syndicate are really into drifting. There's no surprise that they bought new wheel mechanics. <clears throat> this is an Omni Wheel. The main feature of this part is the ability to strafe. Simply said, it is like hovers, but with wheels. You can ride left, right, or even diagonally. Anyway, you'll get a chance to try it for yourself soon. Just admit it, many of you people like to build sports cars. The new update also includes new stylish drifting wheels. The new light wheels camber allows you to change your vehicle clearance by pressing a single button. These mechanics are similar to the ones you know by the wheels stallion, save for the distinctive jump feature. Another peculiar item is a target lighting mode, Enlightenment. An enemy shot with it becomes highlighted for a time and cannot become invisible. To hell with those stealth lovers. The next part in our queue is the legendary heavy cabin Yokozuna. Similar to Kamaz, it will please the players with unusual mechanics. It has the ability to temporarily increase the power and speed of your vehicle and your allies' ones alike. You can activate the perk with a drone that it will create, so to speak, a special aura. Among other equally interesting parts, you will find a melee weapon, Tempura, an epic copter launcher, Yagoi, and a light epic cabin, Janabi. Keep driving through, meet the new season of Battle Pass with new rewards and the old rules. The rules regulating the level gain are the same as before. Complete daily and weekly missions, earn points, and unlock new slots. Of course, we have reworked the task so they would be more varied. And how can a major update do without a new map? Meet a new city location. It is currently one of the Syndicate's outposts. You shouldn't expect a warm welcome. The area is filled with surveillance cameras and motion detectors. Before the disaster broke out, this place had been full of business centers, some kind of a business district. Half-ruined high-rises, neon signs and wires sticking out everywhere fill this place now. A monorail passes through the center of the map, filling the surroundings with its noise. A beautiful view, isn't it? Get ready for your adventure and see you in the wasteland.